Sarah is through as caller number 10, which might be the most difficult part of this contest. What's good, Sarah? What are you up to? Driving to work. What do you do? Uh, I work at Subway. Okay, very good. Uh, You're a sandwich artist, or uh, would you not consider yourself an an actual artist? Of course she is. I am a sandwich artist for sure. Didn't you hear the amazing news on the commercial lately? Uh, You guys are going going back to like 1950s pricing. That's crazy. (laughs) Not all of them are. I know, but it's a big deal. Like, there was a time that, you know, that's kind of the only option when you have an athlete and you don't want to pump them full of like, bad drive through stuff to go to Subway. And then I was like, God, it's getting so expensive. And then I saw the commercial. And now and the actually... health of your young man is in Sarah's hands. It is. How do you feel about that pressure, Sarah? <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Lots of pressure. Lots of pressure. Now, uh, the most important question we're going to ask you today, is it Sarah with an A or Sarah with an H? With an H. Yes. Yes. Let's go. Subway. I have a feeling that Sarah is really with an A, but she's heard us <laughs> mock ladies that have just the A and not the H so much. She knows much our that next she, move. She knew we were going to play it anyways, right? <laughs> Maybe. Yeah, yeah. All right. All right. But good. Now you're in our heads. Right. You know what we're going to do. This is the perfect game for you. She knows how to answer that question yeah. now. So, Sarah, the other question <laughs> we've got to ask you is who's going to give you the best chance at winning three grand here, Cat or moi? Mm, Jay. Oh, go with your first cat. Cat. Okay. Wow, she wanted to go with me, and then she's Dang like, it. I'd rather piss away $3,000, so I'll go with Kat. So, really? You've been waiting, uh, huh? We'll, uh, really? we'll let Kat excuse herself from the studio, and once she's safely beyond our voices, what I'm going to do is just simply give you five words. All I need, Sarah, with an A or an H, is for you to give me the first word that pops into your mind when you hear these. And if we match up with Kat when she comes back, you find yourself $3,000 richer, which buys you a whole lot of Subway. So let's go. Sarah, what's the first word that pops into your mind when you hear the word fun? Party. Okay. How about when you hear sloppy? Second. <laughs> Yeah, I thought maybe you'd say that, but then I really thought you wouldn't. Uh, and I think Kat will likely say that. Sarah, what's the first word that pops into your mind when you hear the word scream? Scared. And the first word that goes uh, directly into your cerebral cortex when you hear rusty. Nail. Good one. And last one, Sarah, what's the first word that pops into your mind when you hear Casket. Death. Okay, we'll invite Kat back to the studio, and if she matches up exactly like you just said, you find yourself $3,000 richer. Now, Kat, I really, really want Sarah to win this money, so as you get back snuggled with your fleece blanket and all your other accessories over here, (laughs) uh, I want you to be true today to your first thoughts. Don't elaborate. So she did opposite. I didn't say that. I want you just to be true to your first thoughts. Don't overthink any of these. And I think if you don't think really hard, which shouldn't be difficult, then you, you know, are going to get Sarah $3,000. I'm going to All right. <laughs> Violence is never the answer. Let's go. <laughs> Nervous, Sarah? <laughs> yeah, but I think the pressure's on Cat here. <laughs> it is. Don't love, do that. I love her no. laugh. All Takes right. two to tango here. All right. Kat, what is the first? And I'm gonna start with, I'm gonna start with what I believe is the slam dunk here. Okay. Cat, what is the first word that pops into your mind when you hear sloppy, messy? No. She said Joe. Do not tell me you said Joe. No, she said what you probably thought first. What? Sloppy. H O. <laughs> what? <Why? laughs> no, she said seconds. Oh God! There it is. I don't live your life, girl. Yeah. I don't know what. No, I just went with you said the first. I know, I know, mind. and that's the game. Uh, let's see what else you would have done here. What's the first word that you think of when you hear fun? Fun. Times. Oh, 
What goes along with fun? Party. Fun party. That's what she said. How about the first word you think of when you hear scream? Loud. <laughs> she said scared. What's the first word you think of when you hear rusty? Nail. That's it, right? Okay. And the last one, the first word you think of when you hear casket. Casket. Funeral. Death. Death. Okay. Is what she went with. All right, Sarah, you got one and a half out of that deal, and Kat not really showing her true feelings. I'm sorry. Off the subway you go. All right. Right. And that's, you have to, from now on, if you ever call the show, you've got to be, hey, it's Sloppy Second Sarah with an H. All right. So you've got all of these things you need to start thinking of before you ever call again, and uh, hopefully it'll be soon. Tomorrow we'll play for $4,000 at? Uh, Let's do it at 720 tomorrow. Okay, 720 tomorrow. Hopefully you can join us. In the meantime, hope you have a great day. You too. Thank you. Thanks for the giggles.